I went to the library at my seminary and I took out every book I could find that had anything to do with same-sex theology or sexuality, marriage, and I started reading them all. And as I did that, I, I kept track of all the arguments and counter-arguments and the scriptures and all the different approaches in a, a huge Microsoft Word document that's now over 170 pages long. And I think I expected when I was going to do that that there would be sort of an open and shut case for the traditional approach, which I had been taught growing up at church. And at first that seemed to be the case, but I remember reading a book by somebody who I would have considered more liberal. And all of a sudden coming across an argument that seemed cogent and seemed cohesive to me and logical. And it, it kind of scared me because it opened up this new possibility that maybe God might be okay with me actually marrying a woman someday. And that freaked me out. 